What's happening, fellas? So, um, welcome back to another video. Uh, the, 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 this, the, the, j j just flash up the lying symbol on screen. The future editing me. Uh, every time I say, oh, I'm gonna get back into content because I always end up forgetting and, and, uh, I keep having to be reminded. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna, <laughs> Hopefully I'm going to get three videos out this week. I have three videos planned for this week, and then I'll see if I can get back in the grind of it. What? Welcome, welcome, welcome back. Um, this this is going to be uh, a video on why Terrapagos is falling off. If you're relatively high ladder, you may see, you may have been seeing less and less Terrapagos. Even low ladder, you may have been seeing less and less Terrapagos. That's because Terrapagos may have fallen off. And there are a few reasons as to why that is, but we'll cover that later. For now, let's talk about what Terrapagos does. Now, for a, for a restricted legendary, you may think these stats are pretty mediocre. And that's because they are? However, it is combined with its ability, Terra Shell, if a bit, and the first hit it takes will always be not very effective. Now, this helps for its general bulk. Uh, it also helps for, like... It counts for all three hits of Surging Strikes, unlike, uh, unlike things like Multiscale. However, its offensive stat isn't that good. Um, you do have Terra Star Storm, um, a move that hits like a truck. If you don't Terra, it's a single target base 120 power move. If you have a few Carmines boosted, that hits pretty hard. That's the thing. It's so passive... That it that, that like it takes multiple car mines um, just to get set up properly. There is the choice spec set with Terra Stars on Earth Power Dark Pulse, and you can go like Flamethrower. You can go Tri Attack, um, but usually you'll see something like Hyper Beam just for a nuke option. Um, with the, uh, with choice specs and Terra Star Storm, that base 105 attack does still hit really hard. However, this isn't the full Pokemon. When you terrestrialize, Terrapagos turns into the Stellar Form, which becomes immensely more bulky, uh, going from base 95 to base 160 HP, and it boosts its special attack up by 20 points. Now, unfortunately, this does make Terra Star Storm a spread move, so now not only does it not get the full Stellar Boost, because Trapagos is kind of, it's like this is now a stellar move and Trapagos is a no it's it's a weird interaction I don't want to get into it um but that's just the thing Trapagos becomes a really good Pokemon only when it terrors and um and we can see uh the outcome of people realizing Trapagos may be may be bad in the victory road to Honolulu tour um as we can see if we look through all of day two, there's not a single Terrapagos in the usage stats. Terrapagos was on set, was, uh, it was like the fifth most used, um, restricted Pokemon in day one. Zero of them made day two. Which is honestly quite surprising considering that, um, normally Terrapagos is used to take, to take on, um, Calyrex Shadow. Calyrex Shadow is supposed to have a bad matchup into it. Um, but as we see, 41% uh, of people used Calyrex Shadow in day two of the Viator. As we see through here, there's, there's, there, are, <laughs> there is a lot of Cali Shadow. And the reason these Cali Shadow teams aren't losing to Trapagos anymore is just because of like the compositions. We can see things like um we see, we see things like parting shot, knockoff incineral, we see um things like Torn Urshifu, Covert Cloak Amoongus, Psy Shot, Calyrex Shadow. Uh, overall Trapagos really doesn't like Urshifu. Um we have things like Golden O, yet again Urshifu. Uh, Urshifu and Mian Shao. Trapagos absolutely despises Mian Shao. Overall, just a lot of counterplay now common against Terrapagos. It's very vulnerable to, um, you know, fake out cycling. Just it, 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 it's just it, it struggles. It very much struggles because 
it either takes a while to get going or doesn't do enough damage. And it's just a massive, like, it's what is known as a Terra Sink. There is also the fact that, yes, while its special defense does get boosted by the Calm Mines, um, the, the Calyrex, they just boost even further with things like Nasty Plot, or even their own Calm Mines, because then, like, Terrapagos's, um, like, its special attack boost just doesn't do that much. Um, on the Calm Mind set, unless they carry Dark Pulse, they just don't like Shadow Rex teams. There's also things like the rise of Grimmsnarl. Grimmsnarl's currently been, been making a big, like, uprising. Uh, Trapagos hates fighting Light Screen, it hates fighting Thunder Wave, um, hates fighting Parting Shot. It really doesn't like Iron Hands. Just, there's a lot of stuff paired against it in the meta right now. Um, and that's basically why Trapagos has fallen off. You just don't get enough value out of it to consistently use it as your main restricted. And I'm going to end it here. I know that was a bit of a shorter video, but in terms of Trapagos falling off, there's not really too much to talk about. I'll release another video in a couple days talking about either um, what to expect of the World Championships or... Um, what was the other one? Or double restricted combos. That one's going to be a fun one. So, um, yeah, take care. Thanks. Thanks for five. Watch. Bye.